better. Thanks for making me smile. What a sweetheart. Okay, so these guys are just chilling on the ground. I'm gonna go ahead and get a photo of them because it's a sweet moment. They're both. Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4 Ultimate Decade Challenge. We are here with our Sims, and they are um, cloud gazing. Um, nothing much is going on. I do need to get him um, healed up because he is very sick still. Um, she is getting a little bit closer to the third trimester, so we'll be seeing that possibly in this, this episode today. Um, and we do need to take care of needs and things. He also needs to go over and take care of the garden because he is not doing so hot, um, with the garden. He hasn't been taking care of it very well. So I do need to send him on over here to go ahead and take care of it. And then, um, he can probably just go ahead and, um, go to the bathroom and then maybe he could just take a quick little nap on the couch, on the bed. I'm going to go ahead and have her come on in. She is going to go ahead and grab a serving of the food because she is kind of hungry. Um, and then I'm going to let her go to the bathroom. Not take a nap. I'm going to let her go ahead and use the bathroom. Um, then I'm going to let her take a nap. And then when she wakes up for her nap, I want her to go into the forest and I want her to find some flowers. So I'm going to have her head on out and do that. And then we can go from there. So it says that he wasn't able to fight off the illness and it has progressed and gotten worse. So that's unfortunate. But it is going, the fever is going down, it says. So I'm not really sure. But he has three more days here um, from the illness. Hopefully we can really cure him of this. Now, I'm probably not going to let these two Sims die um, before they are done having children, that is. Um, just because they're my heirs and, you know, unless an event happens or whatever, but they're my heirs and so I need them to at least start the lineage. So if he was to go ahead and pass away or something or was about to, um, I would probably save him from it either with cheats or whatever, just because that's how it is. But I will let him be sick. Just, I probably won't let him die. Uh, just for that reason, just because like, you know, you want your sim to be able to have babies if, you know, that's what you're after in your game. Obviously, that's what you would be doing. So, yeah. So, I probably won't let him die of anything um, until he is, you know, either going for like an age up check or like roll or whatever. And then he passes away. That's a little bit different. Um, but at the moment... He's not going to be aging up for quite a while, so we have some time with him to get all these 10 baby tries in. Speaking of baby tries, I think tonight at midnight is going to be when we're going to go over and do the baby try or get... I guess we're going to let um, Matilda and her husband Hugo go ahead and um, try for baby. So then they'll be expecting from today. Um, I think... Because of the way we're doing it, obviously we know that Alice is going to have her baby first. So we don't have to worry about anything with Catherine um, in being pregnant until, you know, Alice has her baby. So we have a little bit of time because Alice, I think, is a day away. Uh, yeah, just about. She's got 11 hours before she's in her third trimester. So, yeah, she's getting closer. Um, so what did she find? So in the forest, she found Wolfsbane. She found... Crocus. She found a lily, uh, a bird of paradise, and that's it. So we will go ahead and get this all set up to sell. Now, we do have this live-in store mod, which means that we can sell things um, without technically, you know, having to go anywhere. But unfortunately, it looks like it's not going to let me sell any of these things that we've collected. Why? That would be a good good a good question here i'm not sure he has one daisy okay can we sell any of these i guess not okay so then there's no reason to have this open so we can just close it until we find things to sell okay so let's go ahead and have him maybe wash his face a couple of times we can have him warm himself 
he can go ahead and grab a serving of the food and we can go from there. Okay. So at midnight tonight, I am going to go over and have Matilda and Hugo try for baby because, you know, that's their thing. That's This is the day that they're going to try for their first kid. And um, yeah, we'll get that going at midnight and then we can go from there. What is he doing? Oh, okay. I guess he can't warm himself. I don't know. Grab a serving, dude. Grab a serving. At least get yourself eating. That'll be good. So I'm not really sure um, what exactly is going to make it so that he doesn't continue to progress in the sickness. I'm not really sure if it's sleep, if it's warmth, if it's healthy foods. I'm not really sure. So I will have to um, just try a bunch of different things. Don't eat that. Don't eat that. Don't eat that. All right, why don't you clean this up? And you know what? Since she's kind of hungry and she's pregnant, we'll go ahead and serve up some more gruel. It's not going to hurt us. It doesn't really cost us anything. It doesn't take any of our, our you know, necessary ingredients that we have. And so it's all good in the hood. I'm going to let him head off to bed, though, because I think that is a good idea for him to go ahead and head to bed. Get some rest. Um, since he isn't feeling so good, rest is probably the best option for him. Now, you don't want to let him over rest because I did read that. And I do know that's like a big no-no with this mod. You shouldn't over let them over rest um, because that can actually, um, you know, like cause them to stay sick longer so yeah i just got rid of that person since they're ruining our immersion i don't know who that was or why they were knocking on our door we don't know who that is so they should not be knocking on my door that's that's for sure but okay so we're gonna go ahead and have alice eat a little bit because she is pretty darn hungry and i don't want her to be so starving that she literally can't um function so let's have her do that and then we'll have her jump into bed and once she jumps into bed we'll jump over to matilda and hugo and have them try for baby okay so she is off to bed and we can definitely head on over to matilda and hugo i but before we do i want to show you guys the spreadsheet so you can get in there and show you everything that's going on with that so let's jump on into that so this is the spreadsheet here. Um, today is Wednesday, so it's the Try for Baby Matilda and Hugo, like I said. Um, I did go ahead and um, under this, I did put that, well, these guys, I was going to have them try, so I knew it would happen. But everybody is down to nine tries now. So we've got nine more tries um, because everyone gets ten, so we're good there. And yeah, that's pretty much it. These are the names um, that we can use. Um, obviously we're going to be going for like English names, so we'll try and go with that kind of stuff from the right time period, of course. All right, let's go ahead and jump on over then. All right, so here we are with Matilda and Hugo, and we are going to have them have their first kiss and stuff. So we're going to have her come on over here and talk to Hugo. Um, they are all set up, or at least they should be, to get going, and there we go, and then why don't you blow them a kiss, and, um, what else can we do? We can embrace him, and then let's go ahead and have them, they can mess around in the animal shed since John lives here, they probably won't woohoo inside, um, yeah, so we'll let them go ahead and do this. Good friends. Perfect. And he learned that Hugo's, she would learn Hugo's mess around interests, which is good. But that's what we want. We want them to know each other a little bit better. What is he doing? <laughs> He's dancing to the music. Yes, you get it, buddy. You get it. He is just loving this music. Jamming. He wants to chat with Richard. So that's cool. He wants to chat with his son. Um, I'm thinking about turning these off, but I feel like... Does it turn them off for every household? Or do you have to do it when you're on every household? That's the other thing. Because, yeah. 
Okay. Wow. Interesting stuff. So I will go ahead and check and make sure that, you know, she's expecting um, once we get out of here. Um, only because I just, I need to make sure, you know. Um, let's see. And she is. Okay. Perfect. So there we go. They are expecting baby number one. And we're going to head back over to our Sims at our home lot. Okay. So here we are with our Sims back at home, obviously. Um, they should both be sleeping. All right, so they are both asleep now and things are looking good. Let's go ahead and extinguish the candle so we don't like waste it. Um, she is just about to hit her third trimester in just a couple hours. So we will have her do that here in a second. It looks like there is a fox on our lot. So we will need to take care of that. Also, he is up and ready for his day, so I'm going to have her also get up because she, whoops, not nap. I keep clicking that. I don't know why, but she is, she is definitely in need of some other needs. So let's have her take care of those because I don't want her to die of like hunger or something crazy. I don't know if they can in The Sims 4, but I know they can in The Sims 2, so let's not even let it happen. So I do want to show you guys the family tree today and today is Wednesday in the game like you can see right here. Um, so yeah, we are gonna not, we don't really have any like specific tasks today. No one's birthday or anything. It'll be a little bit before we get into the birthdays and things, but, um, once we do, it'll get really crazy really quick. Okay. So keep that in mind. Um, embrace how slow the beginning of this is because eventually it won't be okay um so yeah we are gonna go ahead and um hopefully we can get some honey from this um thingy out back today that would be fantastic um and then also i want william to go ahead and take care of the bees um so i want him to apply the mite treatment i know we don't have a lot of money but you got to keep that taken care of and also go ahead and collect that honey because that's another good thing so today we're going to try and open up a little bit of the store, um, try and make some monies because that's very important this early on in the game. You need to be making money because you obviously need to have a living. Um, we could plant these bonsai buds, but I think what we'll do is we should probably sell them if we can. Um, I don't know. Can we set these for sale? Like anything I put down, I seem to not be able to do anything with them. If I... I can just plant it. Okay. So we might not be able to sell these um, until we get some from like actually harvesting. I don't know. It seems really odd if you ask me. But I do have this. So this is this little thing. And we could put these all in here. Um, let's see. Orchid. And this is a bird of paradise. This is a daisy and whatever. And wolfsbane. And a dahlia, is that what it was called? Um, and then she also has a lily and a bird of paradise. Oh, and she did get a basket with wild honey in it. That is awesome. Also, we're going to let her go ahead and gather some water today. Um, and he is going to go ahead and stock the table with this. Um, he, he gets tongue from the bees. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, so yeah, we've got some honey now, so we can throw this in here. This is all we have in our fridge, by the way. We are literally not doing very well. Um, so he's not feeling very well again. Um, let's go ahead and see if we warm him up. Maybe he feels better. I'm not really sure. I, guys, I'm not, okay. She's got really bad morning sickness at the moment, and she gives birth in question mark, question mark, because we are in a third trimester. So that's really good. Um, I will let her probably finish eating. And that said set for sale. Yeah, I'm going to set my fishing rod, for <laughs> my fishing spot for sale. <laughs> that's too much. Okay, let's have him take care of his needs. Maybe we'll just let him, I don't know, nap for a second. He did get stung by bees, so it's adding to how upset he is from being sick. Um, so, yeah. That kind of stinks, but it's all right. Did I set this so that it doesn't actually... Um, 
It doesn't sell. Okay, it does store. So we're up to 32 for water. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Why are our bills so high? Did you see that? They seemed awfully high. 488. Um, interesting. I, I really hope the bills are not going to be that much. That's, that's too much. Okay. That's too much. All right. Let's have her come on inside and wash her face a couple times. And then I think I'm going to send her out to go fishing for a little bit and have some fun fishing. She could also do the, the yard sale, honestly. Stock table. What does it say? Alice. Alice Adam needs to be tending the table to start. How do I? Oh, she's too uncomfortable to tend it. Okay. I thought she'd be okay. Oh, there we go. Tend the table, and then we can have her stop, stop, um, her start the the yard sale, and then we should be good. I hope this is helping him. It looks like it's hurting him because it's going up. So I'm gonna have him get up actually. Um. Okay, can he fish while he's feeling like this? Um, go fishing. Fish together with Richard. Hmm. Okay. I might need to look at what we need to do to get rid of the sicknesses so I have a better insight of like things that I should be working on. Instead of just kind of sitting here going, I don't really know how to fix it. <laughs> so I might need to look into that a little bit. But let's have him wash his face. And I am going to have her start the yard sale. I want to mark up the prices to 100%. So we're getting quite a bit more for the sales that we make. Now we probably won't make very much off of this. And that's realistic for the times really. But also um, this... I'm, I only allow them to do one yard sale a day. Um, if they had a live-in store that had something in it, um, they can have it open all day as long as they are, um, as long as they're um, awake, then the store can be open in my opinion. I don't think they'd leave their store open when they're sleeping. It just doesn't make sense. So, yeah. Okay. Oh, it looks like cleaning himself actually helped. Did you see that? It was going down. Um, okay. So maybe it's cleanliness. That's good to know. He is fully clean though. So I think we're good there. Let's go ahead and have him go fishing. And we're just waiting for people to buy some things from our shop. And also, it does say check neighborhood reasons. Okay, so there's nothing to note. Now, please just ignore the people because they're going to look crazy and not like our times. Um, we could probably give them... What is around her head? Seriously, what is around her head? I have to know. What is that? What the heck? Okay, so there's a whole bunch of people. Here's, um, I think Richard and John are here. Oh, wait, that's not John. That's that's him. Sorry, William. Ask what happened. I don't know what he's talking about. Okay, so we just make a little bit of money. So that's kind of nice. He wants to become energized. And she just made a little bit of a sale. Shout forbidden words at him. Wow, that's not very nice. She doesn't want to flirt. So maybe go ahead and... Oh my gosh, it says apologize in bed. Um, Go ahead and flirt with him. Where is this? Flirt. And also we should invite in our sister-in-law. Now she wants to freshen up in the mirror, which I don't even think they have a mirror. Not in their house anyways. Okay. Hopefully someone is going to come on over here and do this. Like, buy some of our stuff. Okay. Let's have... If you stop, can you just invite her in? And then we can go back to it, or what? Alright, and then go ahead and tend the table. 
You don't need to go in. Just she does. He's just playing in the water. <laughs> can he get from this too? Is that possible that they both can get from it? I know you're not feeling well. I know. I also would really like you to go fishing if you can. Yes, he also got a basket with wild honey. Can he just keep... No, he can't. Okay, I was going to say, can he just keep, like, grabbing from it? Or is it something that needs, like, a little bit of a timer? It does seem to need a little bit of a timer. All right, let's go ahead and use the bathroom. Is she even expecting? Out of curiosity. Did we even check? Okay. So there we go. I had it so it was set that they paused their pregnancies, but I don't want that to happen. I want them to progress in their pregnancies. So I had to go in and, and, and unpause the pregnancies on played sims because that doesn't really make sense. Like, I don't want my played households to not progress. So I turned that off. All I want to be paused is the delivery of the baby so that I can go jump over to the households um, when the sim is ready to give birth. That's like what I want. I don't want anything else other than that. Okay, so the yard sale's over. We made a couple of simoleons today. Nothing too fantabulous. Um, we are going to have her go ahead and go on and get some more flowers if she can. Um, I know that that's not really helping us that much, but it's okay. You know what? She could take Catherine. Um, actually, just go by yourself. Okay. All right, so we're going to go ahead and have him go to the bathroom real quick. And then, um, let's see, what else can we have him do? Maybe take a nap, see if that helps him with his sickness, because seems like this is taking forever to get better. Um, he is still very sick and doesn't really seem to be going down, where thankfully Alice did not struggle with this, which is great. Okay, so now it seems like she's progressing. So we should probably speed up her pregnancy. She should at least be first trimester. And it should be showing by now, too. I think it's saying it's showing, which is good. Okay. Because she's like a couple days behind Alice. So that's all good. Hey, I heard you and Alice Adam are good friends now. You're getting more popular. Clearly, you're a good person to know. Why is why is Alice's last name not Adams like it should be with an S? Did I mistakenly do that or did something happen? Can't even... I don't even know. I don't even know. All right. So, it's getting close to Sunday now, which is when we're, we'll be harvesting all of this stuff. So, that'll be fantastic. Um, and then we can start thinking about getting a, um, animal over here, like a cow or a llama would be great. Um, the cow for the milk, obviously, so we can have cheeses and things, um, and make different recipes with it, but also the wool or the llama for the wool, because we want to be able to make clothes and things. So yeah, we have a lot we're working on, but it is going to take a little bit of time to kind of, you know, really get into it. Do I hear the sizzle of something broken in there? Okay, get out of my, get out of my hair. <laughs> get out of my hair. <laughs> Try to what? Oh, lure out rabbits. Okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and get rid of this person. Is that not working? Okay, I don't know. Just don't look at her. <laughs> I wish that you could make it completely stop generating all of these townies who don't look the way you want them to look. And I know someone's going to say, you can use MC Command Center, but I don't really want it to generate anyone at all. And 
And the only mod that I've found that kind of works is MPCC. Um, but it hasn't been updated to the latest version. So it like doesn't even work. Um, and Zero's mod is like for the same issue. It crashes my game. So, so it's not doing great here. We're not doing great. All right, let's go ahead and have her come on in and clean this up. We'll have her go ahead and serve up some food. She can make up some more gruel. It's going to be a lot of gruel in this series. Okay, um, so he's got his honey here. Okay, and then she also has honey. And then she just got some more of the same flowers, pretty much, that she already had. Can this person please... Um... Get her out of here. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw these in here so we can just get them out of our hair. Um, those will be what we're obviously selling. So that'll be good. Where did you just pull these plates from? <laughs> Where'd you pull plates from? Alright, let's get her eating soon. And then we can go from there. How much longer? I really thought maybe by now, but I guess not. Grab a serving. Grab a serving. Go ahead and do that. Is he not going to grab a serving? Yes. Eat. Why are you flipping out? He's still at three days? Oh my gosh, he's not getting better. Ah! Why isn't he getting better? I'm sad. Alright, let's have you clean this up. Then go to the bathroom. And then... I guess you can sleep. I didn't really want you to go to bed this early. Uh, now that he's in a better mood, maybe he can go fishing for a little bit. Yeah, let's try. Let's have him try and go fishing. All right, Alice. She wants to use the bathroom. Yeah, I know. You gotta go potty. Gots to go potties. Why did that just go up? Did that just go up? I feel like it went up. That's weird. I don't know why she'd be like... Peeing and sleeping at the same time, but I'm not going to get into it. <laughs> I'm very excited to meet their baby. Um, hopefully we all don't get too attached because <laughs> we don't know if it's going to stay around very long at all. All right, so he's catching some fish for us. That's great. We'll be able to make like fish head stew or something with it. So that'll be awesome. Um, it'll be a different meal for them for a little while. And I don't think it takes too much to make it. So this should be really good. But yeah, we need him to just keep on keeping on. This is going down. So I feel like we're actually doing something right here. I'm not sure what it is, but we're doing it. So we'll just keep doing what I'm already doing and then it'll be fine. Hopefully it keeps going down. I would love to see that keep going down. All right, Alice is asleep. Aw, I wanted it with the fish. Maybe we can get another one, hold on. Let's see if he pulls out another fish and then we can snap a photo real quick. I was trying to get it to the right angle for the photo, but then it didn't go so well. Come on. Get another fish. Also, we got to have her do laundry. We haven't had her do it yet, and we should definitely get it going. We don't want to wait until it's completely full, because then it's too much laundry. Okay, maybe this one? Is this it? What is that sound? What animal was that? Oh, it's a fox. Here we go. I think he's got one. Nope, it's not a fish. Alright, well, I still got the photo anyways. So that'll be good. 
And yeah, how close are we getting here? We blinking yet? No, not really. All right, I will let her go ahead and get up. Um, I think I'm going to have her go ahead and do the laundry before the baby gets here. So we're going to add it to the whoosh tub. And we'll get that whooshed up and then we should be feeling better after that. He wants to get engaged to Alice. Oh, sweet. Also, we should definitely shoo scraps away. All right, so she's going to do the laundry before the baby comes because that's important. We need to make sure we're keeping a clean house. Um, hopefully, the baby's going to stick around. I don't think we're going to get to it in this episode, honestly, which kind of stinks. I was really hoping to get to it, but um, we're out of time, and she's not in labor yet. So, yeah. So, I'm going to let her finish up the laundry, and then I think we'll probably have them head to bed sooner rather than later, just because with the baby coming... Um, we don't actually know exactly when it'll be here and um, Yeah, they're gonna need their sleep. Obviously all new parents need their beauty sleep. So It'll be exciting. He's getting rid of the fox because we just don't really need a fox on our lot um, Killing off all of the animals. So we're gonna go ahead and have him head to bed and um yeah that's where we'll end it so if you guys enjoyed this episode um please don't forget to comment like and subscribe to my channel um in the description below is all of my social media links and also um please don't forget to check out my twitch channel where i live stream every wednesday friday and saturday from 9 to 11 p.m eastern standard time and also don't forget to check out my discord where you can share your own games um you like your photos and everything there and i will talk to you guys in my very next one thanks very much for watching Okay, so because she's not doing anything at the moment, we are going to go ahead and just have her have the baby. Um, yeah, and I will snap a photo of her giving birth, obviously. So, we'll get that photo taken.